Hey guys, it's Let's Do This Gaming back with another Roblox video and today I'm in the Mermaid Mansion. Yeah, that's right. I am in my Mermaid Mansion and we're going to check out one of the secret glitches in here. I'm just waiting for somebody to come along and help me discover this secret room because what you need for this glitch is a stroller and that hungry rat is really funny, isn't it? I mean, I don't really like Arthro normally, but there are some pretty cute characters. This is definitely one of them. So we're going to find this glitch through the wall here. Now, the way that you normally do this is to push someone through the wall. Oh, everyone's turning up. So I'm going to just change to a baby so I can get pushed through the wall. And I'm going to find someone who's got a popsicle stroller and they can pick me up and push me through the wall. Oh, I can't see anything. Where am I? Oh, don't tell me I've just glitched. Oh, here I am. <clears throat> oh, someone's got me on a stroller. I want to get through the wall, but not... <laughs> let me down, let me down. Quick, get me in there. All right, so I'm going to get pushed through the wall here. And if I have a look on the other side of the wall, here I am. And all I have to do is hop out. And now all of a sudden, I'm in this special room. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Now, I don't want to be a tiny little baby. So let me change my age back again. And there we go. So it looks like Zebby Z is joining me today. And we'll have a look through here and see what else we can find. So there's nothing down here, but if we have a look through here, we can see that we can see the outside of the building. That's pretty cool. And we can also jump up. No, I don't think we're gonna jump across. What I'm gonna do is get my glider out like this. And, oh, the hungry rats joined me. How did, oh, he teleported to me as well. So I'm about to take off right now and check out the rest of this building. So you can get through here and let's have a look up here. See, let's see what this looks like. Yeah, this is the top of the building of the Mermaid Mansion. That's pretty cool. Let's go around to the side here and uh, see if there's some other cool things because I'm pretty sure there is. So maybe go underneath and we'll discover the bottom of the swimming pool. So that's pretty cool too. So let's just drop here and we'll just put that away for now. Now this is the water inside the actual mermaid mansion. If we go, we can actually swim inside and Zebusi's jumped on my back, so that's pretty cool. And oh, she needs a shower. Oh, always dirty. You'd expect to get at least a little bit clean when you're in the water. But we're still swimming, and if we actually just try to pop our heads up here, we might be able to get to the top. Let's see what happens. No, we can't see anything in the top there. So this is the outside of the Mermaid Mansion. So this is a glitch room, and you could literally build some cool things here. That would be pretty cool. So let's go and uh, have a look around. What else have we got here? Can we actually see up in these little sections here? Oh, I've fallen down. I better get myself a glider very quickly and start flying. Oh, I think I just saved myself. So let's go. There is the uh, Mermaid Mansion now. But what I want to do is take you on a little ride to the actual Adopt Me world. So, ah, oh, and don't forget to subscribe to Chloe's Magical Tree. And it's time for school. So we're just going to keep going now. Like it seems like it's a bit of a distance. Uh, I'm going to actually speed this up so that you don't have to wait for the whole time. But, uh, oh, cash out, nice. But as you see, uh, where we've just come from, which is somewhere, well, there we are, above us there, uh, it's actually getting further away. So let's quickly go over here and see what's over in this park. Okay, so we're almost there. Now, I don't really understand what this is. Maybe this was a test world or something like that. But uh, it's kind of like the basis of the Adopt Me world, but you don't get everything in here. So we're almost there and we should be able to drop down now. So it's actually a platform and now people should be able to teleport to me. So oh, apparently ZBZ is trying to teleport, but I don't think it's working. So this is the swimming pool. And um, yeah, obviously you can perhaps get up here and climb up or maybe go down into the swimming pool there. So it's really weird, but uh, if we keep going, let's just keep going a little bit further and uh, we'll just go over here to the actual presence area. So we've actually got one of these balloons in the water. There's a car here. Uh, there's some people that have just teleported to me, but if we actually just stop here and put this away, we can actually see we're underneath the, the gifts. And when people turn up, 
they actually come here and drive on top of us. Someone's just turned up in a bath, a bath car. Did we even know we had a bath car in Adopt Me? That is pretty cool. I wonder if I can just get in there. No, see, I can't sit in there. So I'm kind of like underneath the world in Adopt Me. It's pretty cool, and uh, you can really only get here if you have a glider or know someone who's getting here and teleport. So these things here look like they're the wheels, but they're the lights that you see above for the gifts. So that's pretty cool too. Now I'm pretty sure I can't jump up there. Maybe I'll grab a balloon and see if I can just jump up and see what happens. Yeah, okay, so I can jump up here and land on the gifts but I still can't really see anybody. Okay guys, so I just want to show you the glitch in the Mermaid Mansion. It's a pretty cool glitch and it's pretty standard for any of the Adopt Me houses. Uh, you just need to push someone through with the stroller and the Paddle Pop Stick uh, stroller is actually perfect because it pushes out quite a long way. So you just need to get the person on the other side, they hop out and then you can teleport to them. So that's pretty cool. Hey, and don't forget to subscribe to ZebbyZ's channel, and thanks for helping me out today in the video. So until next time, it's bye for now.